A misconfigured link led to an unintentional disclosure of 38 TB of Microsoft data, making it possible for malicious code to be inserted into its AI models. Cloud security provider Wiz recently scanned the internet and discovered a software repository on Microsoft's own GitHub. The repository contained open source code and AI models for image recognition. A Microsoft employee had set up a URL on the affected GitHub page, granting access to an Azure storage container of AI models from the software repository. However, Wiz's report pointed out this URL enabled more than just open source models and could be used to access the entire storage account, exposing other confidential data. This was supported by scans showing that 38 TB of data was available on the container, such as passwords to Microsoft services and 30,000 internal Teams messages from 359 Microsoft employees. Even scarier, this link was created via a powerful shared access signature token, allowing anyone who visited it, including potential attackers, to view, delete, and overwrite the content. Considering the fact that the repository was used for AI model training, an attacker might have been able to inject malicious code into every single model, which any user trusting this GitHub repository would have been infected by. Wiz informed Microsoft of this in June, and the company acted quickly to seal the gap. Microsoft declared that no customer data or other internal services were impacted by this issue. The company disclosed that the storage container exposed was home to backups and internal Microsoft Teams messages that were related to two previous employees. As part of their security measures, Microsoft has been diligently checking for SAS tokens with overly permissive expirations or privileges on GitHub. They confess that the tool failed to detect the particular SAS URL mentioned by Wiz in the Robust Models Transfer repository and marked it as a false positive. This error has since been fixed, and they confirmed that their system is now detecting and reporting all overly provisioned SAS tokens correctly. This incident serves as a warning to ensure correct configurations to cloud storage access accounts, particularly those keeping extensive datasets. Wiz further stated data professionals and engineers striving to deploy new AI solutions need to take extra precautions to guarantee the safety of the data they are handling. The company's report further highlights some of the safety issues that may be associated with SAS tokens on an Azure account. Microsoft declares, however, that you can quickly void a SAS whenever needed by revising its main key. What's more, it is possible to carry out precise revocation at the container level without having to alter the keys of the storage account. Stay connected for regular cybersecurity news.